thank you guys for watching this video. If this is your first time here, please hit that subscribe button and like this video. Today, I'm going to show you guys my process of making a loop. Tomorrow at church, we are doing a song called Nobody Like Our God featuring Myron Butler um, in the International AME Church Mass Choir. So I know the BPM is 132. So first, we're going to start with a shaker. I'm going to pull up um, sampler and I'm going to pull up the samples that I use. I'm going to use an array of different samples. The first one I'm going to use is Premium Church Samples Volume 2. The first shaker that I use is going to be super simple, straightforward on the one, two, three, and the four. So it's going to kind of act as a metronome, but we're going to stack it later. So check this out. I'm going to double click this, select all and press Q. Now what I'm going to do is hold option, drag this over. Now I'm going to add another shaker over top of that. And we're going to do a little bit of variation with the shaker. Shaker 2 has a little bit of variation going on. I'm going to drag this over. And we got it down a little bit to kind of blend it in with shaker 1. I'm going to pull up Stylus RMX. And we're going to find a shaker in here. All right, let's record that. Let's add a clap to this. Those claps sound really good. So we're just building up the loop, making it move. The goal of the loop is always to move and have variation going on. Let's add a cowbell now. If you're looking for over 30 high quality loops, you can now go to my website and cop my new signature gospel loop pack. For only $25, you can get access to over 30 high quality loops ready to use in your DAW of choice. So if you need loops for church, if you need loops for production, go ahead over and check out my signature gospel loop pack on mkbaileymusic.com, link below. I wanna add a tambourine now. Let's keep going. Let's add a triangle now. Let's add a kick now. And we'll keep that kick just on the one at the top of the loop. I want to pull up um, premium church samples. I want to add another shaker. I'm going to duplicate this track again. Adding small stuff like that in your loop makes it <laughs> a little bit more fuller. It's not doing much, but it's just something to add to it, you know? That is how you make a loop. If you found some value in this video, please hit that subscribe button and like this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. We are out.